Paul says the build-up for 2022 has been going great as he focuses on building on improving on what was the breakout year in 2021. But what has he learned that can help him as he looks ahead to this year's racing calendar? I would say racing experience, um, getting more races under my belt, and that's a big thing in sprint cycling. So I would say that's one of my biggest improvements I would say I made, like just being able to be comfortable on the bike and to be tactically sound when I'm racing. Always looking at ways to improving his performances on the international stage, the 2021 one km time trial world championship silver medalist is aiming to do better in the major competitions that he will attend in the future. I have three main goals, I would say. One being the Commonwealth Games, then Pan American Championships, and also the World Championships. So those are my three big goals for this year, as of now. So, While not being present for the just concluded National Sprint Championships due to training at the UCI headquarters, Paul was happy to see the local guys back in action and had praise for the likes of fellow Olympian Quasi Brown and up-and-coming sprinter Zion Polito. It's always a pleasure for me to see my fellow teammates um, doing what they love, going fast and being able to go out there and ride their bikes. So for him to accomplish this and another achievement under his belt, I was really happy for him. And I'm always happy to see the younger generation coming up behind me and that's one of my biggest motives are um, to inspire and to show the younger generation that there is a way and that the sky is the limit. Paul still dreams of the day when our Twin Island Republic will have a full cycling team representing us at the Olympics. We are usually accustomed to seeing one or two cyclists, but to have a team, to have endurance riders, to have road cyclists like Daniel Campbell even, road cyclists, I just want the numbers to expand and for everyone to be able to qualify for the Olympics and to live that dream. The Gasparillo native wants Trinidad and Tobago to continue to support all cyclists as they do their best representing their country. Kent Fuentes, TTT Sports.